Hello everyone, my name is Logan Mansion of Logan Mansion Games, and I'm pleased to welcome you all to a game called Five Nights at the Chum Bucket. Now, this is a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game, and it's also a sequel to uh, Five Nights at the Krusty Krab, but the first game wasn't working, so I, I have to basically play this one. Night one. <laughs> Easiest one. enough of that man. Why, hello there. You must be the old security guard. <laughs> I've been told so much about you from my superior. Allow me to introduce myself. For all intensive purposes, I am the second in command here at the Chum Bucket, and my boss has put me in charge of you. You and your buddy on the phone there have caused us quite a lot of trouble by escaping that fire. We can't have anyone finding out what happened at the old restaurant. That's where you come in. No doubt your friend out there is going to come and find you. So, we're keeping you alive until that happens. Essentially, you're going to be acting as bait. Don't get any hope from that, though. You're still on our hit list. Though, unlike my superior, I prefer a much more indirect method of killing my prey. <laughs> Let me explain. You're not alone in this restaurant. Inside is a group of animatronics, just like your old job. This time, though, their sole function is to kill you. From the hours of 12 until 6 in the morning, those doors at the side of your office are going to be open, and you'll be a very easy target. However, as I'm a good sport, I've given you access to the restaurant surveillance systems through the monitor on your desk. Using it, you'll be able to track their movements, and if they get too close, you can close one of the doors on either side of the room. Simple enough, right? We don't even have power restrictions here. Nothing to worry about. There's a catch, though. The doors have a malfunctioning heat sink, and thus will overheat and short out if they're kept closed for too long. On top of this, the generator can only supply two pieces of equipment with power at any one time, and that includes both doors, the camera, and the flashlight on your desk. So be sure to use them strategically. That's all for tonight, though. There's more to tell, but it's not quite relevant yet. I'll let you know when the time comes. Anyway, good luck. You're really gonna need it. <laughs> yeah, well, fuck you. Why the fuck is there a bathroom show? Bathroom camera? Why is Patrick in there? SpongeBob? There's Mr. Krabs. Is this Kevin McCloud? Yeah, the aftermath. Hi, I'm an egg. Is that Flumpy? Hi, I'm an egg. Hi, I'm my name's Logan Mansion Games. There's Patrick and Mr. Krabs. I think that's Sandy.
Okay, good. Squidward's still right there. No! Fuck you, SpongeBob, you dick! Spongebob, why well, he's all buff. He don't need no anchor arms. SpongeBob's right there. Not SpongeBob, because he's right there. Is there a camera surveillance system in the bathrooms? And that wouldn't that be considered sexual harassment?
Go away, SpongeBob. Just fuck off, will ya? F is for fuck up, why don't you listen? U is for you suck balls. N is for never come around me, so go to... So go and piss off now. Okay, thank God he's gone. Is that something been over there? boy and that there was uh five nights in the film uh, i might be back with more of this game another time but for now i'm just gonna end the video right here that was kind of cool actually it's like both two things i like spongebob squarepants and five nights at freddy's but you know i think i'm just gonna end the video right here but if you liked it make sure to click the like button and subscribe if you would like to see more videos from me let me know your thoughts in the comments section but as always thank you all for watching have a great day bye everyone